FinScope Tanzania 2017 is a huge uh, nationwide um, demand side survey that seeks to collect data on the financial landscape, but more important, tries to understand the needs and behaviors of the people. The financial sector deepening trust in an interest to drive uptake and utilization of the insights that are derived from this study has taken upon itself an interest to really uh, convene different industries within the financial sector to ask themselves questions on what does the FinScope 2017 data mean to us? Uh, we have done this through a series that is dubbed Data Solution Sprints that brings in industry players to look at the data that FinScope offers, understand what the data offers, but more important, take the time to reflect on what that data means to the current solutions and what that data necessarily means to what they could offer the market in the future. If we go back into the actual work that was done, there was a lot of reflection. Participants actually going back and actually seeing, so what does the data look like for them? How does that affect their, their, their operations and what they've been doing? Uh, and being critical about what they see in the market and also about themselves. And hopefully that will provide them with the insights, the data, what they have, and how they can improve and better understand the person who's most important in this case, who's the customer. I think it was quite insightful. Uh, we, we got to see a broader landscape because uh, like any other bank, we tend to focus on our customers. We tend to look at data or information based on how our customers transact. But this time around, we were able to see what else is out there over and above what we thought we knew. So through that, we actually realized that we are only, we're only tapping 7% of the population and there is like a majority of um, potential out there that we have not even touched at the moment which we need to focus on. One insight that I found very interesting is uh, the fact that there are about 300 microfinance institutions in Tanzania and 200 of them are in Kinondoni. That was quite interesting uh, which means that there's a problem with the proximity of access to financial services to our final consumers. Everything that we are doing these days is about data. It's about researching what people want, their problems, and then as a business looking at how we can solve those problems. These events that uh, FSDT are sponsoring um, are what can help us think out of the box. Remember, research is expensive, but these people, they've done the research for us. So they've really helped us out. Um, so yes, it is a good concept of having it there. I think the insight and the data that they presented was uh, quite eye-opening um, in the sense that they went down to the details and I think the level of the information that they have given us um, will really impact our strategy, our business models in terms of how we do our marketing as well and how we reach our consumers or our customers. It's easy to become complacent because everything obviously is process driven, but if you sit in your own little corner and you think you are still in control, you wake up the following day, you find that uh, you've got small players in the market who have actually taken over. So the most important thing is to be in a place like this, interact with other like-minded people so that you are able to not only grow your organization, but you are able to do good in the community. So we are really excited uh, about this series. We believe that this will allow uh, market players to think deeper on what can be done better with what they're offering at the moment, but what are the disruptive solutions that could also bring into the market as a result of their understanding of what is happening in the market.